This video, it was a combination of two days. I combined them together because it just pretty much saves time and the first day wasn't too long. So on the first day we went to this uh, little place uh, that has a lot of goats too. It's like the whole, there were like four or five stores that sold goats too. Esperias de las Nueve something. Um, it's close to Centro and I'm sure you can find it here too. Um, I had some lunch with a couple of friends. We had a, a couple of different types of foods, tacos and stews, which were really good. And it became my staple. So I kind of ate it for like three or four days afterwards. This is that good. And then on, and you know, on that day, I just came back and I rested and I wandered out at night, just walked around a bit, but nothing too much happened on that first day. So I combined, I'm combining on the second day here. And on the second day, I wandered to my new uh, area near the Airbnb that I'll be staying at. So I was just walking through and catching different clips. There was a little arena where they have uh, jaros, which are like, it's like the rodeo equivalent in Mexico. And it's pretty cool. Uh, eventually I have to make a trip out there to see what's going on with the show there. And you can find pretty much everything here. Uh, Sam's Club, Costco, Walmart. Um, and kind of caught a glimpse of that as I was walking through. Found a really cool park in front of my house. It's uh, a nature park. You can, there's a dirt trail that you can run around, as well as a jet, little jungle gym. And found some doggies too, so that was always a plus. And then, actually, I combined even further, and then it was the day that I actually moved in to this new apartment. So, it's on the 13th floor, very nice view, I enjoyed it a lot, and uh, on the day I moved in, I got there in the afternoon, Juan got there towards the evening time, we went to go find some food because obviously we were hungry, uh, rode into the Sam's Club, and then checked out the park nearby, I wanted to show him that, but finally settled on a Pojo Asado place, kind of right below our apartment, so that was nice. Um, wandered into the Sam's Club to buy stuff that we would need, but they sold things uh, too much in bulk, and Juan was only here for a short time until he comes back, and then he'll see after that if he's going to return, but uh, wandered into the OXO, which is kind of like a 7-Eleven near the gas station. We got some snacks and uh, beer uh, just to try. I had the lactose milk that they had, and it was really good. Um, I think I'm going to be buying that, especially at a dollar a piece. Uh, that's probably going to be my main source of protein. We finally decided that we weren't going to do probably whey protein. Uh, it was too much to carry around if you know after we leave this place. So that might be my main source of protein. Came back to our place, hung out, and just chatted, caught up because he's been in Monterrey, I've been here, uh, caught up on stories, and uh, yeah, just tried the Indio beer which is all right. I particularly didn't enjoy it as much. Uh, I much prefer like sweeter beers or uh, other types of beers, but uh, in, in Indio is a, a local beer here in Monterrey, Mexico. So people are very proud of it. And uh, it's worth trying if you're here. It's only like four or 5% alcohol, I think. But that's it for this video. And uh, I know the video is a bit long, but I hope you enjoyed all the clips. Looking for the jungle gym so that we can work out. Um, this I like this dirt trail though. Uh, great for running. Not a lot of people here, and it's very peaceful. Smells great. A lot of fresh air. In the new apartment, and this is the 13th floor of the um, the building. Uh, we got the living room, we got the kitchen with gas stove top, uh, washer dryer in the back, refrigerator, microwave, got a blender, awesome for mixing drinks, um, shakes and proteins, I mean. And this is the view of the 13th floor. A lot of uh, industrial complexes around here. Uh, don't see too many restaurants. I think we'd have to wander over towards that direction. There's a mall, a big mall over there. And then there's a university buried somewhere in this city here. 
And uh, this is the living room, I'm trying to get connected to the Wi-Fi. Speed is about 40 up, 40 down. It's not too bad, it should be enough for streaming. Um, we got a little studio here. It just some chairs and uh, a table. I guess we can move those things if we really wanted to use it. Uh, I've got a bathroom. And then this is the, the first room. It's a little bit smaller. It's a queen size or a double size. And with the fan, there's no central AC here, but that's fine. It gets pretty cool here anyway, so you can open a window. Uh, nice, nice view of the city. <laughs> and then we have another room with a king size bed and just a coat hanger and it has their own private bathroom. Uh, everything's pretty cool. Yeah, pretty nice apartment overall. Uh, should be enjoying it here for the next month or so. Just gonna get settled in here and go find lunch. Uh, I, have, I was walking this morning all the way over here, about 45 minutes. So I'm not too hungry yet, but it's, you know, it's, it's about that time to go grab some lunch. There's a subway nearby and there's a um, I guess a, a grill nearby, so we'll check that out. Anyways, um, that's my place, and I'll tell you guys more about it later. I gotta say, I love this apartment. Being on the 13th floor and opening all the windows, you get mad, mad ventilation up in here. <laughs> um, only thing is that the doors slam if you don't kind of prop it against uh, something. Um, but a lot of air ventilation, Got four windows open, uh, great apartment except one thing, there's no shower curtains on this one, <laughs> besides the point. Um, everything else is great, got this like huge TV, uh, we're going to be probably watching a lot of dev videos on here, and maybe some movies sometimes, I'm guessing this is a 60 inch, but the guy didn't get the cable working when he came in. So I think we'll just hook it up to like Netflix or whatever uh, movies that we have. Uh, this is kind of the view. Yeah, it's near the industrial complex, so you're not going to get a lot of uh, wonderful things to see. But I'm curious to see what it's like this evening. Yeah, I've been making like, I'm on the second one now. Nice. I gotta edit the third one and set it up. Um, what's your impression of uh, Guadalajara so far in our apartment? Um, <laughs> Guadalajara, um, compared to Monterrey? It's way cooler, I guess. Uh, temperature, temperature wise. Temperature is too cool. People so far are nice, friendly and stuff. The apartment is. Pretty bomb, right? <laughs> bomb, right? Yeah. <laughs> um, we're just at a restaurant right now down this down down the apartment. A little like two minutes from our house. <laughs> and just getting some food here. This is a Sam's Club. It's almost the same as in the States. The MacBook Air is nineteen thousand pesos, which is nine hundred and ninety dollars. So thousand. Yeah, that's that's thousand. pretty same price. Yeah. yeah. Got back to the apartment. A um, little bit of a rain. Shower that came through. I think everything's okay. It's not wet. Just got these 10 liters, both for only two dollars. Sick. A dollar for one of those. How much was your um, carbonated water? Can't remember. Six, eight dollars, right? Six or eight dollars. And got some shampoo and uh, just necessities. Empty fridge. <laughs> We're gonna try to get more more necessities tomorrow, like whey protein and other stuff. Sam's Club just sold way too much. Their prices in general were the same as about the U.S., so we figured we can go to another smaller uh, store that we can get all our stuff that we need. Yeah, yeah, spicy though, right? Yeah. They have a lot of different ones. I like uh, chicharron. They have this one next year. It's chicharron. Oh yeah, I mean, that's basically what, what this has. Like, how do you see where it should be? So, 
this one? Yeah, yeah. This is right there. <laughs> I like those Ekis. I tried those Ekis. Yeah, this is, you might like it. Which is good. This was 20 pesos? Yeah. It's not bad. No. And this beer is supposed to be pretty good. Indio, 4.1%. We'll see what it tastes like. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, this is what I ask whenever I go for coffee. I ask for this. That's our protein shake right there.